When they asked Lachman physician what to feed for a patient, he gave the following answer. Do not feed him bitter words, feed him whatever you feed him. This saying of Lachman physician emphasizes feeding not only the body, but also the soul. He explains that people should feed each other with kindness and love instead of hurting each other with their words. This advice of Lokman physician reminds us how careful we should be in communication because the power of words can affect people's mood and health. Therefore, we should pay attention to what we say and nourish those around us with loving words. The deep thoughts and wisdom of Lokman physician and Ibn Khaldun have inspired humanity throughout the ages. Lachman Physician's healing words and Ibn Khaldun's deep analyses on history and society are just a few of the valuable legacies that humanity has carried from the past to the present. Ibn Khaldun is known as a historian, philosopher, and sociologist. His work shed an important light on how societies are shaped and evolve. Lachman Physician was not only a physician, but also had deep thoughts on moral virtues, patience, wisdom, and justice. This video is inspired by the teachings of Lachman Physician and Ibn Khaldun. Their words are profound and impressive, shedding light not only on the past, but also on the present. Let's take a journey in the footsteps of these great thinkers and discover their words that shed light on us. Ignorance is like a pasture that is diseased and has bad air. The ignorant man, under the influence of this disease, separates the truth from falsehood collects what he comes across and conveys them in his work, but no one can resist the power of truth. The devils of falsehood are caught in the fire of ideas. Sacrifice your world for the sake of your hereafter. You will gain both, but do not sacrifice your hereafter for your world. You will lose both. The human mind is like a millstone. If you do not throw something new into it, it will grind itself. Forget the evil that others have done to you, but never forget the evil you have done to them and try to eliminate it by doing good again. We endeavor to repair our world at the expense of destroying our religion. However, then neither our religion remains nor our world that we have patched. Mischief destroys most of the wealth. The poor without patience is like a lamp without oil. The rich without generosity is like a tree without fruit. The state naturally leads those in power to live rich and ostentatious lives. The means of living of those in power increase, their living conditions change. The expenses related to the wages and rewards distributed by the rulers increase, and in time the income does not cover the expenses. When you are in a congregation, guard your tongue from speaking useless words, for the tongue leads a man to the rope. Compassion is not a guest in every heart because it is innocent. Do not be asleep while the rooster is crowing in Dicker and Tosby at dawn, lest he be wiser and more diligent than you. Cities also have a soul. People living in a city become characteristically identified with the soul of the city they live in over time. He who thinks carefully distinguishes truth from falsehood. The touchstone of a mature person is consulting wisdom smiling face, self-control, and enduring pain. The friend you value the most should be the one who informs you of your faults and does not show timidity and fear because of the position you hold. Physicians cannot find a cure for stupidity. The end of excessive humility is to listen to the advice of the mediocre man. There is no friend in this world closer to me than knowledge. Knowledge is worth a treasure, for you guard the treasure and knowledge guards you. Time disciplines the one whom his father could not discipline. A lazy person is one who sleeps too much, who is estranged from Allah, and who inherits poverty. It is easier to move mountains from one place to another than to unite hearts. Do not look to the right and left, always look in front of you. My fluttering is not for joy, the captured bird also flutters. My recklessness is not out of joy. It is because I remember some events. Never forget two things, God and death. And forget two things, the good you have done and the evil you have seen. Knowing geometry is to the mind what soap is to clothes, which cleans and purifies them from stains, dirt, and rust. 
Do not despise the small. Smallness is only recognized in the presence of Allah. It is right for you to turn away from those who turn away from you. When you see people closing their doors to you, leave them so that Allah may open another door for you. When you speak, do not mix sarcasm and joking humor into your words. It is a law of Allah for his servants that those who are engaged in oppression and corruption have a bad end. A scholar among the people of the earth is like gold in a mine. Knowledge is like a well and argument is like its bucket. A scholar without action is like a cloud without rain. What is happening to me that I do not serve the one who created me? Keep in touch with your relatives. Be close to them. If you accustom the nafs to abundance, it will want abundance. If you accustom it to little, it will be content with little. Gluttony and anorexia are the main enemies of the body. Habits change the nature of man in the direction of what he is used to. Therefore, a man is a child of his environment and habits, not of his lineage. For health, do not eat too much, do not eat hot, do not eat raw. Make it your habit to eat little, sleep little, talk little. I have never seen anything more beautiful than the harmony in how many beautiful people have looked at me without sleep. Do not miss the measure in sleep and food, because those who eat too much and sleep too much will arrive at the day of judgment empty-handed in terms of righteous deeds. Turks are people who love charity and good deeds and hope for reward and rewards. Do not covet the welfare and happiness of others. Mathematics changes one's behavior and even makes one honest. The axe wounds the body, the bitter word wounds the soul. After the body dies, it is certain that the senses are dead and the veils that prevent the soul from rising are removed. It is necessary to walk after eating. Injustice destroys civilization. Do not put your fingers in your mouth and nose. Even prophets, in order to defeat others, have to find like-minded companions. Protect your heart from temptation during worship or in moments of desire to commit sin. Do not attempt to defend it, but direct your feelings towards good. Those who forbid knowledge or keep people busy with lies are the greatest enemies of reason and humanity. Know your friend at the time of good or evil. Thinking has been abandoned by the Muslims, and that is why they have become miserable. Doubt will not make you a friend of anyone. Traditions that are blindly kept alive do not mean that the dead are alive, but that the living are dead. Do not do to others what you do not tolerate for yourself. Man is ignorant in his essence. He becomes a scholar with the knowledge he acquires. Do not despise anyone because his clothes are old, for your Lord and his Lord are the same. The desire for lust and inclination to evil is stronger in human nature. Speak truthfully, but not harshly. Know that when a day ends, it ends with all the possibilities and opportunities it carries with it. Do not expose your wealth to your enemies. Do not pour face water on anyone with the concern of profit and loss. In times of famine, it is not hunger that kills people, but satiety to which they are too accustomed. When you go to someone's house as a guest, keep your eyes and tongue tight. Avoid glancing around and chattering. Every mind denies what it is not able and cannot comprehend. Do not discriminate between friend and foe in favor. Allah is the one who has ordained everything, and there is no Lord but Him. If it is not in your power to build a heart, at least let not the heart be destroyed from your tongue. States, just like people, are born, grow up, grow old and die. Treat your friends and friends with respect. The defeated imitate the victors. Do not make suspicions about people whose goodness has been experienced. Where are you from is the most divisive and unfortunate question in the literature.
If anyone asks, I am from the world. Do not eat your own bread at other people's table. The past is more like the future than water is like water. The world is a sea, its ship. The captain is the prayers and the shore is the hereafter. When the nafs gets into the habit of something, it becomes a part of its nature. In the time of youth, let your affairs of both worlds be honest. Know that the essence of logic is to prove. He who has no greatness will hit his head on a stone. Treating people according to their degrees is also a part of justice. It is very rare for people to recognize the perfection of others and their superiority over themselves. Turn to Allah with sincerity and trust in Him all your life. The dissatisfied cannot establish civilization. Do not trust anyone who has had enmity with you in the past. The people are servants who can only be protected by justice. There is no more effective and potent medicine than love and affection. If I do not surrender to fate, I will be like to crack. Make the person you will make a friend angry first, examine his deeds, and make your decision. A person who thinks too much about sexuality cannot achieve great things. The beginning of anger is madness. The end is regret. Gratitude makes the blessing abundant. Do not get involved in anything without being asked. Do not fill your stomach completely with food. Your mind will be incomplete and your understanding will be scarce. Do not praise yourself or someone from your family in the presence of others. Do not offend anyone who needs you. Do not adorn yourself like women. Keep your feet warm and your head cool. Find a pastime for yourself. Do not think deeply. There is no disease without cure except lack of will, no plant without value, except not being recognized. Do not be negligent of deeker in prayer, even for a moment. Otherwise, you will be condemned to the evil spirits wandering around us. Forget the favors you have done to your friends. Do not expect thanks from them. Expect the reward from Allah. Bind your ambitions to his favor. Never forget death and do not fear it. Death is a great reward for the righteous. So prepare for death. Thank you for watching this video filled with the teachings of these great thinkers, the healing words of Lokman physician and the deep insights of Ibn Khaldun offer us inspiring thoughts. Don't you agree? If there was a teaching or saying that particularly caught your attention while watching this video, please share it with us in the comments. Your thoughts are very valuable to us. Also, don't forget to subscribe to our channel to support our channel and to be informed about similar content. Do not forget to turn on notifications to be informed about our new videos. Thank you, and we are grateful for supporting us for a healthy and conscious life.